playing and to know the prodigy versus enzo the hokage are our we will tentatively call it top 16 matches uh all of our top eight players seed right into winners uh, and then we go from there first ken we're seeing of the evening so far yeah which is we were talking that character up so much in my top eight on um, my top five here and we only saw the character like once tonight. But it's Mike X. It is one of the premier cans. He is a Capcom Cup qualifier. Couldn't come in and put in the work. Having both busted, with my personal opinion, number two and number three in the game. Oh my goodness. And right now, Mike X is just showing off the gym right mix up. Yeah, he's getting everything that he wants out of Adrian in this corner. But that's a nice back throw to be able to get out of that situation. Yeah, let me go ahead and get that extra damage on the soft screens. Okay, OD uppercut out of Mike to try to work their way out of the corner. No, we were late on the punish. We even specifically chose a situation to bait out a reversal or a drive reversal. Right. Not ready for the pickup. Yeah, man, uh, got uh, like Mike actually got away with a little bit of missing that uh, that follow up there. Uh, but you know what? He still takes around here and trying to see if he can navigate this boom situation that Adrian is trying to put together. What is uh what is Guile's low forward on block? I don't know if you know off the top of your head. I can pull up the frame data on the side. The reason I ask Same. is Mike took the turn after drive rush low forward, uh, and I would expect that it would be plus. So it needs to be right. it, minus no, five. Wow. It's only five? minus one out of drive rush. Wow. wow. Okay, Mike teaching me something about the matchup that I needed to know. Because I, 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 I complain about that button in particular for Guile because you get so many different options out of it. It's a good poke tool. It can also target combo Ooh. into it. But man, what a jump in. But man, like, uh oh, bait is going in. <laughs> my guess is not going to let me finish my thought here. Going into level three. This is burnout. Very close. Burnout. To yeah, I mean, Adrian right now. Oh, no, we don't. Yeah, That's just you should just do like run. Kick, yeah. OD fireball works. That whiff punish could have been everything. Now, I mean, this is really about will Mike get uh, smoked by a reversal level one if Adrian gets the opportunity for it. Mike in burnout now, actually. Adrian could cash out that level two and really yeah. start to chip away at that lead here. No, overcommits going in behind the fireball, gets jumped in on, and Mike secures the first game. Like, man, I get it, but Mike just snipped that out all the way, man. He's like, yeah, I know your game plan. I got a counter. So, like, that jumping was insane, dude. Yeah, it was a, a brilliant timing to do it, using the right button for it even as well. Uh, and it was in a spot, I mean, if Adrian had just waited a little bit longer on those uh, anti-airs, it was just the one opportunity that they tried to extend and move forward. Parry pump for the follow-ups yeah. off of the Jinrai, but we're not really going to get anything Ooh. for it. Shimmy Both works. Ankles. Oh, the breaking of the ankles right there. I'm getting fisted in the face, man. Oh, my God, man. Just fist. That stand fierce is insane from Ken. This is a, so good. Like, this disgusting button to deal with. And, yeah, you know and here's, you're seeing, like, a difference here, like, right? Yeah, Mike, absolutely. Uh, Adrian, Adrian is not anti air. You saw he tried to attempt to parry the anti air coming in, and it's kind of costing him a lot of this uh, different options. Mike X, because of that, like he's saying, you know what? I got the anti air game on point. I'll be able to kind of close this round out. Yeah, no, I, I think you're absolutely right. And Mike is also getting the better of the fireball game on the ground, which is not ideal. I think it's just because Adrian has not ended up in the position to be able to set up Sonic Blade safely to get the type of control on the ground that they want. Now having the drive gauge advantage, though, it makes it uh, feel a little bit better for them. Nice whiff punish, no combo drops, but yeah, man. Being, having them in burnout is huge. Oh, the duff. You know we go going to level double one. That's not gonna kill. Oh, but we can play for chip. Yeah, I, I, I guess I understand. I, guess, I think it would have been oh! a little trouble. Oh! My dex is my dex is crap out qualified. I think this is stuff that's gonna go, uh, simple thing is gonna work. Got the overhead. If... Gonna try to get. Oh, oh, what that a was, flash kick! That was a good flash kick, bro. I was like, I can't. <laughs> so way to end it. it was like, oh I my still god! Warned it falls to the ground. What's a real shame is that overhead kick, if it had been buffered into the level three, like I'm sure Mike wanted it to, mm -hmm. it would have been massive for them. Yeah, man. That would have been a nice closer to it. Instead, you just start up the damage this way.
Yeah. Well, hey, okay. That one was close enough, so Adrian gets the link off the punish counter. But Yo, the fireball game is he... still good for Mike. What is he? Three for three for that se exact sequence? I think so. Uh, man, oh, the OD fireballs. Yeah, yeah, I think every single time Mike throws an OD fireball, Adrian is setting up Blade and loses. That's probably why we're not seeing that uh, that Blade uh, situations that you kind of want to see and talked about before that he's not able to set up. Uh, so I definitely want to see him kind of like, see if he can be able to uh, play, the, play, the, play the pace of the game a little bit more, just kind of step back a little bit. I know that there's a bunch of options that Mike X is really good at getting in. Usually uh, some like Jinrai or... Yeah, man. Oh, my God. Wanted for the shimmy. Nothing really comes of it. Keeping the pressure going. Jinrai, low option. Parry uh, just to get some of the drive gauge back. Nothing off the low forward, but that. the shimmy works. Mm. Get it in there. Let me do another fist in the face. I dare you. Don't flinch. Don't flinch, son. Take this throw. Nice tag. Oh. oh. My God. Oh, no, but you put yourself in burnout. This is actually a really scary spot for Adrian. I love yeah. that corpse hop, but did believe that they had more respect from Mike than they did in a Mike on set point. Indeed, man. I, I definitely like the option that he went there. I thought it was going to be a little different, but uh, mm. didn't work out in his favor. Okay, that's a good castle out into the drive rush. The OD fireball again. Uh -huh. Drive reversal. No, the wrong choice of counter poke button there. You could have put Adrian into burnout. Oh, Adrian keeps committing, I think, one move too many in his sequences and getting smoked for it. Yeah, man, it's absolutely been costing him a lot of this game. There is a, finally a drive reversal that works with you. are still in burnout. There's the anti-air. Pretty much got one more guess before the stun is coming out because he's trying to get as much ship as possible so he can get to that game oh. set match situation because he has a level three locked up. Okay, there it and is. Counter poke, but that's gonna do it off of the wall slump into the level three. More than enough damage on deck for Mike to close this one out. Uh, that was pretty decisive, if I do say so myself. Yeah, pretty much. Like, there was a lot of situations where, yeah, uh, Mike guys didn't get like the punishes off like uh, driver reverse, the, the black driver reversals that he wanted, but he didn't really have to do too much. And there was another thing that uh, Adrian was seemed to be slacking on, and it was like going in and going for the meetings because that was the second time you saw in that replay that he mm -hmm. got hit with wake up jab and going to that uh, comp that tried to chew Ken combo ended with the DP to get that extra damage closed out. Yeah, so. and you were talking about that standing fierce, there's another button in Ken's kit that I look at and I think it doesn't